It's me, Greg Miller. You're watching Kinda Funny's live reactions to the Animal Crossing Direct. I'm one of your hosts, Greg. I already said that. This is Christmas in February. Joey Noel. Woo! And the Guys, Rogue One. Exciting. At Gary Witta. I'll give you a live reaction to being up this early in the morning. Yeah, yeah. What the fuck am I doing? <laughs> We're here well, you to don't watch. Even have to be 25 here. minutes of Animal Crossing direct with you, the audience. Kevin, are we still doing these the same way? We're going to hit record on it when we get closer. Or are we recording now? Hey, everybody, on YouTube.com slash Kind of Funny Games, we're getting ready to watch the Animal Crossing Direct, so you're watching this later. People watching it live on Twitch, remember, we're on Twitch.tv slash Kind of Funny Games all the time doing live reactions, live stuff. You should be part of us over there. Right now, I'm putting out the tweet. Hold on. Come watch the Animal Crossing Direct live with us. Yeah. Uh, Joey, what are you expecting from this as Kind of Funny's biggest Animal Crossing fan? Oh, man. I hope that we get to see a little bit more about what we get to craft in this game. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, and I hope we get to figure out what these, like, Nook Miles are. Because I'm not 100% sure Explain what Explain to Gary what a Nook Mile is. Uh, I yeah. guess it's just some kind of scam, like everything that's Oh, yeah, totally. Was. It's another yeah, time Nook They're selling you, you know, is it like the vacation package. And you earn these Nook Miles by doing, I assume, these, completing these quests kind of things. And then what happened you to your eye? What's going on with your eye as we have I don't know. As this is going live, Joey's going blind. <laughs> Did you catch uh, Tim's thing? Oh my gosh, is it just proximity? This is awful. Exactly. Um, and then it's like it seems like it's like a secondary currency to buy like unique in-game items or I'm all crafting about it. Let's go. Let's uh, go. things. I don't know. I'm interested to see what see. Um, multiplayer feature. I know because the last time they made a big deal about how you can visit each other's islands sure. and like cause everyone in, the, in our household will be playing it. Me, the kid. And my wife will all be playing it together. So I want to see how we can like all play together. Yeah. I'm hoping they'll talk about that today. No, I, I just want, I don't, I have no idea what I want. I, you know what I mean? I'm just excited. I'm in the desert so thirsty for anything Animal Crossing. I just it, want this game to come out. Animal Crossing feels like it's out tomorrow and then at the same time feels like it's out in a year. It's only a month away. Right? I know, it's but it feels. today. It's literally a month It out. feels so much further than that after we've waited so long. I can't wait. With the delay, it exactly. just seems like. Every day. It's the little carrot dangling day, in front of us. That glorious day is coming. I know. I During GDC. Lame. The last day oh, of GDC. Oh, that's right. Yeah, exactly, right? You How know dare what I mean? That. Yeah, yeah. So now, uh, Gary Witta, no one expects you to actually make it today. Me, me they, least of all. They all thought you were all full, you know, just full of talk on this one. You, you, like I said, I'm mostly here out of spite. <laughs> just to prove it's Kevin a wrong. Tremendous <laughs> motivator. The yeah. look on Kevin's face when he walked in and saw me here was 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 worth it. He was like, "What the fuck? He's actually here." For you, where does your Animal Crossing fandom start? I mean, I, I I'll be honest. I'm probably the least Animal Crossing uh, fervent person in my household. But that's gotcha. that's just, my wife and my kid are both like they're really. We into talked it. about this like we had dinner last night. We talked about this like my wife goes all the way back to the GameCube version. Yeah, she used to be hard. Oh, oh, here we go. Here we Shut go. up, Gary. Nobody cares here about you anymore. Here we go. Let's get it done. Everybody, welcome to the live reactions. It's Tom Nook, if you didn't know. It's Tom. He's so cute. He's I love eyes. Island. I love this. Never does. Just look how peaceful it is already here. This is all I want. I feel like I'm on one of those things where you go and get like a, you go get a timeshare and you give you like a free set of Yep, gold. totally. Yeah, 100%. Yeah, yeah. All right, now before we give you your free voucher for dinner, you need to sit through this twenty-five minutes. Okay, part one of the refresher on our getaway package. A reminder of what we okay. So the one we have. Part two: future development plans, DLC. Everybody. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Kevin, aren't you excited to find out what you can spend your money on in the All future? Right, so let's let's get brought up to date. Let's have a little recap. Do we need recap Thank juice for this one? Choosing the milk I don't think so. Deserted <laughs> island getaway package. <laughs> This is one trip that we I'm gonna catch that butterfly. can recommend with confidence. Oh gosh, all those flowers. Your destination is a peaceful island where it's the little things that count. Look how cute their outfits are. Designing your home and simply enjoying life. Oh, fishing and games is the bane of my existence. I like fishing. The bane of your existence? I'm it's so really easy and fun, Animal Crossing. It's high time we detail the many features and perks included in the getaway package. I did play package. the hell out of Pocket Camp, I'll say that. I love uh, I wish Camp. that there was tying in because I spent way too much time in there to not get it. That was your idea, it. remember? I remember when I saw you playing, I was like, you're back on pack, Pocket Camp? You're like, yeah, I think it might tie in. Upon arrival at the local Please airport, right, look, you arrive in a little seaplane. deserted island positively teeming with nature's bounty. What, the smooth jams, man. I love, I'm like, just the whole vibe. Oh, this is the game the world needs right now, so yeah. we can all mellow out a little bit. Ooh, you can choose your oh, okay, island. Different islands. Yeah, all right. All right. Different layouts. Would you like to live in the northern hemisphere? 
or the southern hemisphere? I wonder what difference that Nor makes. Northern hemisphere, best hemisphere, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Oh, there you go. Oh, oh okay. Just like real life. Ooh, I wonder if I can change them ever. And then I, that's going to be important. And you're going to. Shit, we got to do this. We got to do this. So one thing. on each of us? Yes, one of us okay. has to do. Oh. All right, so, okay, so the first one not people. pushed it March 20th, still Oh, my God. In. That was my main fear. That we walked in and Greg was like, lights. hate to break it to you, they're going to delay it. No, I mean, would have been, we would have had to take to the streets, Joe. Oh my yeah. gosh, I would be riding. We would have marched on Nintendo. Do you think we could flip a smart car, Gary? <laughs> if we oh, were riding easy. in the street. Easily. You'll see a wealth of lush greenery, not to mention a veritable treasure trove of bugs native to the island. Come autumn, the color of the leaves on the trees will gradually change. Kevin, they're saying the chat so direct volume the activities up. Available okay. to you, from collecting seeds and mushrooms to gathering autumn Hell leaves. Hell yeah. Look at those colors. As, as long as we've gone without a direct people. Oh, I love winter. The island That's my favorite season, I think. That's my favorite season, I think. Oh, look at this. Activities Can you make a snowman? A jolly good time. Look at their little snow outfit. And the night sky oh, is freak out particularly that spectacular building. this time oh, yeah. of year. That little size. As you can see. When the seasons change, the activities available to you oh my change God, along with them. <laughs> <laughs> the simple joys of nature are just one reason that the island Christmas is such a time. great setting for your new life. The little lights are so cute. Not long after your arrival, you and your fellow residents will receive an orientation session from the Nooking staff. More like indoctrination session. Drink from the chalice. At this time, you'll be provided <laughs> like with a tent included in your getaway package. A tent, very nice. You can chat with other residents about where you want to set up your new home base. Kevin, are you really not into this? Does this, does this, does this not delight you? I know. I was and gonna say, doesn't this look so much fun? Sure so relaxing. Move, Just listening to the fucking wind and the trees sounds good. All well. these jams? Yeah. Hopefully, you'll agree that cooperation between residents can be pretty fun. I do. I do agree. Although you're moving to a deserted island, you're still getting That's a package deal. On the okay. island, we've included two facilities to make your life there more comfortable. Visit this tent in the plaza to access Residence Services, which is here to support all of your daily needs. It's open 24 hours a day, providing residents with services such as the sale of everyday goods, the purchase of unwanted items, and helpful advice about living on a deserted island. And by attending our free DIY workshops, you'll learn how to craft a variety of items. Do you like crafting things? I do. First, just learn but the then DIY it recipe. Just feeds my hoarder tendencies exactly. where I don't, don't get rid of anything. anything. <laughs> then choose what to make. And there you have it. It's ready. As you can see, with enough recipes and the right materials, you can build a plethora of wonderful things, even on a deserted island. You'll enrich your life with your own hands. This is something I enjoy doing. My Have wife, I think, really enjoys with doing DIY like crafting? a little cam setup. Well, well then, start yeah, 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 yeah. customization we'll workshop. Oh my gosh, stuff. yeah. Where you can learn skills like changing the color of your mm. DIY furniture or decorating them with your own custom oh, designs. Oh, look at my sheets. My cool sheets. I want the little pop oh, ones. sheets. Making the tools oh, and furniture pillows. you need by hand I love is of vital importance on the deserted island. That looks like a whole needs our wish that you can learn DIY like a, skills like by oven? taking advantage of our workshops. Brick oven for your pizza? Airport. Very important Nook to the island. Welcome to the airport, where you'll first land on the island. It's also available for use year-round, 24 hours a day, beginning take? the day after your arrival. A little dodo. At the airport, you can oh, use the Orville, internet or sweet. local wireless <laughs> to invite residents of other islands. Oh, there you go. Okay, this is what I'm interested in. Yeah, this is what it's more about here. Invite players to your island via local wireless. Or and you can okay, also great. travel to and visit other islands yourself. In this way, up to eight people, including you, can be on a given island at one time. You're not allowed to Feel free to get a good I'm not going to fuck it up. And We're going to team up cool shit and do photos like this. At one point you say you're the just going to come fuck it up. More than I did say that, but I would never do that. It There's also offers an in-game postal service, allowing you to send messages. Feel Ooh. free to use this service to interact with other residents.
Will this be your first time living somewhere so remote? On a deserted island, no less? Yeah, people are Don't worry. Uh, Here are three big ways we yeah. plan to support to you him, in acquainting yourself people. with your new surroundings. Special service. God, geez. Starting a new I'll just speak really so loudly until you turn me up, Kevin. Nook Inc. will provide <laughs> some do my basic own necessities controls. as well as services. Oh <laughs> no need to worry. <laughs> I'm, I hate that bed. You know what I mean? Oh, you'll still upgrade. upgrade. You'll upgrade. You'll upgrade. I know, I know, I know. But I'm, that's what I'm saying. Okay. I look at this What's the deal with the Nook phone? It has the standard so apps like a camera and map. Yeah. But over time, I think we that's how you keep all your... I hate you, Nook Files, yeah. Recipe, yeah. All your deserted what? island <laughs> needs. <laughs> Alright, let me know Let me know when I can stop being loud. <laughs> at the start of each day, oh our what is CEO, this? Mr. Nook... Like Tom Nook with these propaganda broadcasts? Remember, Tom Nook is always watching you. The latest on important island, island events, wide, deserted island life thanks, advice, thanks, and Thanks, thanks, Kevin. Special service number Special three. Special service number three. Since this is likely your first time on a deserted island, we're offering guidance and inspiration it doesn't seem that deserted. the Nook Mileage Program. There's like a lot of people there. when you're looking to participate around. in some activities. Okay, Nook Miles. Some recommendations. Yeah. Here we go. And as you have these experiences, you'll build up miles, like so. Okay. And what do you do with the miles? Well, you're going to find out in a second here. The miles you save up can be used to pay off the cost of the getaway package, and they can eventually be exchanged for in-game rewards okay. at the Nook Stop Terminal in Residence Services. Nice. So do you still use those? range no? from in-game Nook Inc. merchandise to helpful items that can enrich your time on so the So it's island. just like the... The old Animal Crossing is like Tom Nook's got you over a barrel oh, financially oh, yeah, from yeah, the very totally. start. Like, you just pay, you're constantly in debt to Tom Nook. You yeah, but on this day. deserted yeah. island, this raccoon owns your ass. Yeah, now. Uh, but he offers it to you interest free, and you can pay it back literally whenever you want. It's really not that. Bad. I mean, that is nice. It's not like Tom Nook sending. I can't, do, I can't do that. It's over my head. I gotta get it done, and then he puts another story on the tent. So we'd like to take this opportunity to talk about some. This should be like a hardcore mode, right? If you don't pay it back on time, like Tom Nook sends the boys round to you know break your legs or something. Oh my gosh. Dangerous creatures, guys. Encounter dangerous insects such as wasps or scorpions. If you get stung, you may end up somewhat irritated. Oh no! Oh, I don't like that. Oh yeah, the classic. Should you come across one you don't think you can catch, try not to push your luck and consider retreat. Oh shit! They fucking chase you around. <laughs> oh yeah. Symptoms can be cured with medicine available at residence services, and we recommend keeping oh, no, some. Oh no, Kevin! Why would you say case. that? Yeah, you're using bells here. So it's a little bit. Island, it's just secondary. Nooks, I think the Nook miles are going to be very specific. Like, yeah. You never you know what creatures might be, be lurking out there. Please be careful when taking a late night stroll. The giveaway package promises a little adventure. So if you think about it, this is actually a plus. Please tell me I get to make the a ghost The deserted bus island is surrounded by the sea, like which means Luigi you can come across a DLC from time to time. Ooh, a castaway? Someone's washed up on the beach. simple. First, like Wonder Woman. give them a holler to make sure they're doing okay. Then keep them company until they wake up. Look at all these cute little purse accessories. I'm into this. Support you can. I like all these new patterns. They're relying on you to make it home. Although your Nook phone has a map application, it's theoretically possible you could get lost or find yourself unable to move forward. In situations like these, it's best not to panic. Instead, Rescue <laughs> service. All right, that's good. Service. They won't let you get stuck. Yeah, I, I don't even want to know You'll how many bells this is going to cost. Cozier in no time. I wonder how you can get stuck. Big Island. I love this. Just fast travel Given back home. Given the services night. we've introduced so far, there should be plenty to enjoy on the island already. But if you want your in-game life to be even more comfortable, I we do. will offer a number of optional extras. I want all of these things. I want all the, 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 the add-ons. Does the environment seem a bit rough? Do you need a little more space for all your stuff? Yes. If you said yes to either of these questions, yeah. then we have an option for you. Yeah. Building a house. Yeah. God, you can't live in a tent your whole life, can you? No. Oh, but he gets now he's going to get you on the mortgage as well as the vacation package. Okay, Jesus says, yes. Er, he says, is the similar Stardew Valley? Yes. A 
house offers so much more space than the tent you'll start with and also has its own storage spaces capable of holding any furniture and baggage you're not displaying. Ooh, storage. That way, everything's nice and tidy. Ooh, I like that. You get to be your very own exciting. interior designer, setting up the walls and flooring however you like. Really get the most out of living there. Look at all these options. I like the, I like the hardwood floors. Yeah. We've made it easy for you to change it patterns at any or time. Vertically. As you can see here, we do some of the heavy lifting, freeing you up to focus on redecorating while viewing the room as a whole. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, this is cool. Ooh. All right, game changer, everybody. Right. Yep, yep, yep. We get excited about the littlest things. If like you own a house, we can also that. That's what Animal Crossing is. Additional right? extension and remodeling services. What ah, oh, look at this. We have appropriate plans available, so please don't hesitate to ask us about them. It's gonna be an excruciating month waiting for this game. It's gonna be really bad. It's gonna be here before you know it. Can be exchanged for in-game rewards, including Nook Miles tickets. These can be used to travel to distant islands. The oh, so here's something else you can use your Nook Miles with. Time. Go to different islands. And depends on how the pilot is feeling. They're mystery tours, so to speak. These far-off destinations are small deserted islands. Wow. Uh, so this is my way you might get like rare uh, yeah, collectibles. Exactly. You'll get the things you have got. Back home with you, whether it's DIY materials, get some peaches, different or native fruit. It's a nice change of atmosphere, and you may experience some unexpected encounters. Cute. We're Kill. certain these tours will yeah, prove right. to be one of our cool. most popular services, leading to many repeat customers. Why no, he's been chased by spiders. It's my worst nightmare. Curse in the chat says travel to a Without unique plan, deserted island. Up to eight it. users can live on one island. I need to read, we need to look at that small print later. Yeah, well, let's just say, yeah. Only to those islands with, with one switch in one game, you get up to four. Party play. With this way to play, you can call up other residents who live on the same island as you. Yeah, this is what I mean. This, this is what I wanted. Party play. Up to four residents play together time. using Joy Cons. Oh, I love it. Calls the others is the leader. <laughs> The followers. Look at that cute little vest. So that's lo that, this is local, right? This is all yeah, local play. Everyone can spend time together. Oh my god, my kid's gonna love this. As you can see, it's easy to change out the assigned leader. That way, followers can quickly take turns doing what they want to do, even if it's just a little shopping. Interesting. Creatures or other items found by followers will be stored in a recycle box at the Residence Services Building. Please make sure to stop by and pick them up later. Fossil? <laughs> we are developing a web service within the Nintendo Switch Online app for real-world smart devices. It's called Nook Link. As an example, the service lets you scan QR code patterns of custom designs. With such a tool, you can use your smartphone's camera function to scan the QR codes of custom designs created in the Ooh, Animal Crossing uh, that's Newly cool. or Animal Crossing Happy Home Designer games. And then Ooh. download them via Nook Link. You can't create them in game. When connected online, yeah, you no, can right. talk with owners of Animal Crossing New Horizons and the Nintendo but That means Switch you can scan in designs that the community's uploaded, right? Yeah, I guess that's the, the, the community I need you to start making kind of funny shirts. That'd be really cool. Best friends. This link is planned to launch in March of 2020, soon after the scheduled departure included in your deserted island getaway package. We hope it will enhance your experience. So somewhere between the 20th the and island. the end of March, yeah, we'll that'll go live. <laughs> well, yeah. If you can't say oh. it's day and day, that's trouble. Yes. Sure, why not? Yes. Talk? Give us new information. Don't worry about how we understand it. Right? the DLC. Let's go. Let's right, part two. Fucking go. With the getaway package, you'll really get that deserted island bang for your buck, especially with only a couple of neighbors for company at the start. But our 
hope is to eventually invite more residents and develop the island into a bustling community. For this reason, we're planning to invite more animal residents to come live here. That said, we don't want you to feel like we're inviting others into your space carelessly. As such, we've secured this land in advance. And in some cases, you may be able to invite some residents yourself. Birdman, get it? <laughs> but we won't stop there. We're also planning to build additional facilities on the island. Yes. Examples include a museum showcasing the rich ecosystem on the island. Oh, that's pretty. <coughs> a shop full of ready-made furniture and goods you can't craft yourself. That's not all in the launch. A table no, offering clothing stuff. and fashion items. <laughs> Joey's not thrilled. And Understandably. And invite guests for recreational purposes. Hoping to enrich our museum residents' looks lives so good. and foster a sophisticated usually. culture on the island by gradually adding shops and facilities. This will be free, right? This DLC. From some you think so? Look. Our CEO made in the past. Look how cute all this is. I like the hats. The resident services center is only a simple tent now, but we plan to eventually expand this tent into a proper building. We will also continue to expand our housing business, which is one of the main departments of Nook Inc. We can and will offer to expand or remodel your house so while providing moving services for your house or local facilities. Also, <gasps> my girl! For remodeling, we'll lean on staff experienced in providing operational support. That way, we can offer the utmost in services and advice regarding the overall environment of your island. Look how cute she looks on her little island shirt. We're mm -hmm. hoping to accept not only new residents, but also any guests who are tentatively paying a visit to the island. First of all, tourists are always welcome. In these cultural this exchanges, we can this show visitors what oh. makes our island so special. In the same way that we're talking about what happens with you. Just 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 oh, right, okay. Got it. Which with. makes sense, because yeah. this is also basic Animal Crossing stuff we've seen before. Right. I'm ready for some cool outfits traveling merchants. Oh my gosh. can offer up items that cannot be crafted on the island. What am I going to have on my island? And eventually, we will host a variety of events for you to take part in, such as fishing tourneys and bug offs at the bug -off. plaza in front of resident services. Through free updates, we plan to introduce special events with seasonal guests Ooh. and more. Mm -hmm. Halloween, and Christmas events, Easter, Thanksgiving. Yep. Groundhog Day, I guess. Sure right you'll agree that <laughs> Mardi Gras, maybe. Ah, that's, a <laughs> that's a better one. That's better. That's better. Attractive proposition. But I hope here there's something for Groundhog Day. We really want our residents to create a one-of-a-kind island that they're proud to call their home. To help you develop Look at all these ways to traverse. Yeah, I like that. Vision, we're able to offer you a range of additional services. These include ways to help you and Ooh. your fellow Oh, nice. I like the bridges. Oh, Pricey. Just Look at those bells. Just kidding. This is so much fun and so cool. You'll be able to comfortably walk around the But I also kind of do like pole vaulting over like all these little bells. Sure, sure. Bells. I mean, trust me. You saw how much it was, like, what, 168,000 <laughs> bells for that bridge? You're going to be pole vaulting. Once the island is fully decked out, we will provide you with a permit. Mm. What's going on here? Can you actually change like the topography oh, of the island? Oh man, you're actually really fucking building up the island. This is great. Oh my gosh! Wow, look at that, make a little In sand addition, pit. We can also provide you with a permit that allows you to undergo major construction on the terrain itself. Wow! Oh! Oh, this is all very exciting, Kevin. And this is a great time to get into Animal Crossing. This is like very Minecrafty. Yeah. Yeah. 
With your very That's probably not an accident. They probably said, like, how do we make this a little bit Minecrafty? That's pretty. Yeah. The island. Make the most of them. Come the fuck on. Island, Come the fuck on, guys. Are you guys sure you don't want to just announce that you're going to release it right now? Yeah, I know, That'd right? That's really cool. As you've seen today, the Deserted Island Getaway Package offers you a wild new life surrounded by nature, I just as make a its name suggests. <laughs> or you can lead a comfortable life in a perfectly planned community. The choice is yours. My town never looks as cool as I would want I know, it to right? Look. But I, with all this terraforming <laughs> here, like, I think you have a shot at it. The Deserted Island Getaway Package, presented by Nook Inc. Your departure is on track for March 20th of 2020. We're looking forward to meeting you all the on the island. All right, what they part three they said was a fact. I do, Tom. I do. I have. Chat, talking about we haven't We're all in. We're all in. I hope it answers. So many people in the chat have been like, what is this game? <laughs> <laughs> okay, here we go. Can I play the game together with my family? On That's a Switch good question. System? With one Nintendo Switch system in the game, up to eight people in your family can live on one shared island. The maximum number of residents for an island is eight. Each user can register one resident. And each resident can, of course, build their own house. Does the game support Amiibo? Yes, the game supports Amiibo figures and Amiibo cards from the Animal Crossing series. We have a bunch of those at home. This music is 10 out of 10. It, it's, they are crushing it, guys. You can also invite these familiar faces to Photopia, an island that exists someplace out there where you can place models and create a photo shoots. Huh. Wow. We plan to support additional care. There's KK. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. Do you have any more information about visiting friends? I don't visit my friends. While visiting other islands online, you can communicate with friends or players not registered as friends using temporary passwords. These features can be restricted via parental controls. Okay. In order to protect the environment of your island, some tools like axes and shovels are forbidden in visits with friends. <laughs> oh, I like that. Yeah. I Leave my trees up, alone! Can't fuck up Joey's time. However, friends who are registered as best friends can use these tools. It's no oh, that's problem. nice. Oh, I, don't know. I, swear, I, I swear I won't do it. I will not friends. fuck up your time. But we can do this together. We can. Okay. What if I lose my save data? Great question. You're fucked. <laughs> Animal Crossing New Horizons does not support the Save Data Cloud feature. But, boo. However, we're but, planning to offer huh? a service for recovering backed up save data from the server in certain circumstances, such as console damage or loss. So well, that means you why not, why not just put it in the cloud? Yeah. Though? Yes. Ooh, I love it so beautiful. much. It's so fucking beautiful. I never use my dock and I would use this dock a week before the game launches. A separate matching carrying case. Leo already ordered that case yeah. as well. Yeah. I ordered the one from Japan Nook that's Inc. like supervised the, the console design. Oh, so the actual console is available a week before. Yeah, the Friday. Before. I still think it's kind of lame they didn't pack the game in. It's even like a digital version. Yeah. yeah. Yes. We will offer free updates yes. after the game launches. Yes, and free we'll DLC. And provide free seasonal events throughout the year. I love the seasonal events. The first free update will be on launch Ooh. day, March 20th. Nice. By installing this How update, I even know it's you an update. can celebrate <laughs> Bunny Day with a special event in April. Also, Fun we're day. planning to roll oh. out a special offer for both Animal Crossing Pocket Camp and Animal Crossing New Horizons, through which players can receive special items in each. Oh. 
I don't want my items going back to that. I want all the work I've already done. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, my pocket camp progress should go into. Announced at a later date from the official Animal Crossing Pocket Camp Twitter account. So stay tuned. Uh, food's rolling up right now. Look how happy they look. One final tip. One more thing. One more thing. Follow us on Twitter. <laughs> I think those are Nook's kids. Those are Timmy and Tommy. Those are very important. If you don't know them. Oh, oh. Miss Bell's walking. What she got to say? Oh, she's just, so she's just winking at us saying goodbye. <sighs> just Look at that. That's the, li that's the life I want. Right? Like. Just soak it in. I know. Listen you know. to it. You just listen. You know how they're always like, oh, if you could live in any video game, what would you want to live in? This is absolutely it. Animal Crossing? Yeah. Yeah, that's the one you'd go to? Espe specifically, this island one. Like New Leaf? Eh. I won't lie. That's the best looking Animal Crossing I've ever seen in my life. And I've I mean, played, just, I mean, I've played what, every Animal it's Crossing. It's what you want, isn't it? It's, yeah, it's Animal animals. Crossing Ultimate, basically. Yeah. The, the, the turning dream. the island into the town, like that's what it's all about for me. Mm -hmm. Where it's like, that was the one thing I wasn't like sold on in terms of this whole thing was the idea that I'm on an island. Like that doesn't do it for me. I want yeah. like the community, but turning the, uh, the community in, or the island into the actual community. Hell yeah. What'd you think, Joey? Uh, I'm, there's nothing in there really that I'm like mad about. <laughs> like not good. I, that's usually not what you want out of an Animal Crossing. Well, direct. I feel like directs kind of are like kind of all over the place. I'm like, man, they should do this, but like, I think I'm gonna sink a lot of time in. What this. was the most exciting thing to you? Um, I'm excited about all the crafting. Yeah, like I want to make all the things. I want to do all the things. The Nook Miles. I am interested to see like what all of these like weird specialty items are. Yeah. Um, and how that kind of plays out. And it is will be interesting to see if they're rolling out content later or if it is just like progression based. Um, with like all the basic stuff. Yeah, it doesn't. Uh, definitely, as we got deeper, yeah, that, it seems like no. That's just as we play the world that progresses around us and goes. I'm so excited. Gary, what was your read? Yeah, look, it's. It, I think it's everything that Animal Crossing fans want. You know, it's not. They're not turning the world on its head or anything. It's just. It's more of the same. But that's. I feel like that's part of what you want in Animal Crossing. Like Animal Crossing is a safe space where you can go totally. and forget your troubles yeah. and live in a peaceful, tranquil world where everyone's nice and friendly and like i fucking need some of that shit in my life right now <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just trying to figure out like what the big new thing out of today was i guess it's for the me, terraforming i was yeah. gonna say it's terraforming going yeah. in there and like minecrafting like you were saying you know like, di digging out putting in the bridges going in making the waterfall go like that like actually being able to go in there and make the island look like yeah exactly because i like, was talking about like how how much you want to make your space your own and sometimes the only limit to that is the geography of the island itself but you'll yeah. be able to change that too now yeah yeah yeah, yeah. i can't wait it's that gonna looks great. be so good, and the music also yeah, great. Yeah, of course, of course. So happy, so happy, so peaceful. Yeah, yeah. I'm looking forward to. I'm, my my big thing is I'm really looking forward to the whole family playing it because my wife and kid love. Like I said, they have long time associations with Animal Crossing. My wife goes all the way back, all the way back to the N64. My kid plays uh, the the uh, 3DS version. Sure. Um, and she couldn't be more excited. The, the, the whole household's excited for this, and I love the fact that we'll, we'll all be able to play together. Now, here's the question. Are you all playing on one island, or are you going to have your own islands on I, your own well, systems? I, we'll figure that out once the, once the game you comes out. Do each have your but own I, Switch? We will when the game comes out, because okay. we, have a, we have a regular Switch. you got to uh -huh. do your own islands. We got the light for my kid, mm -hmm. and then my wife had to have the special edition, so we're getting that. And we'll get three... Three physical copies of the game as well, just sure. to make sure there isn't any bullshit with like, oh, you know, you cannot use these features or whatever. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, but yeah, so, but I, I like the fact that you'll all be able to also locally play on one yeah, screen. Yeah, yeah, go in there and screw around. Yeah. The yeah. thing that does suck is that there's no cloud save. So if you start yep. playing together on one Switch, you can never, you have to restart your island if you ever decide. Well, to Well, that's it. normal. That that I understand. If we started an island together, we can't separate off yeah. or whatever. It's more the idea that like. We're, like, but even if you start a different island, oh, I guess you would but, have to stay on the same island. If all yeah. three, no, if all three of us start our own individual islands, can't we? Can't we at some at any point like all three of us go to another island? Okay, yeah. that's yeah. what I want to do. Yeah, yeah. I think back to I was talking, telling you this story last night at uh, dinner, right? When it, when it, Animal Crossing was on GameCube, and we had one GameCube in the house of the seven guys I lived with, and only you know five of us played. But it was that <laughs> thing of like, oh, you're going to class, I'm going to pop on the island, do some stuff, and how cool and fun that was. And like, yeah. it doesn't work in a modern setting at all because right now. It would be on the weekends 
you know, Jen's on the island tinkering, and I'm like, can I, can I, can I play? You know what well, I mean? the one, the one, one the one bit of family drama, and I think it's good that they've designed it this way. But the one bit of family drama I can anticipate is that I'll tell you right now, there's no fucking way I'm giving my kid those shovel privileges when she comes to my <laughs> island because I know she's like, Daddy, why can't we be best friends? Up. I'm like, because I know you're gonna fuck up all my shit. Yeah. Um, but you know, well, if, if she behaves herself, I'll let her have shovel privileges because it'll be if, if you are genuinely all best friends yeah then it'd be fun to you know make stuff together trust me joey just let me into the island i'm gonna have very limited people that i'm let giving me into the island. one of the things that i've always liked about uh nintendo is they're very very good at um uh mitigating like troll like behavior sure. like you know you can you, everything's so locked down that you can't really mess you can't really mess with people in Nintendo games. Yeah, uh, like you could, like you could. You think oh, I'll go to your island and start digging up all your shit. Well, no, you need permission to do that. Yeah, I like that. Yeah, the, the cloud save back to that right is a bummer for me because, and I know heavy is the crown. W you know, we're gonna get early code at some point, right, to review this. Mm -hmm. And so if uh, I have to make that decision, if I'm buying that Animal Crossing fucking Switch, and if I am, it's got to fucking be here before we get review code, which I doubt would happen. Nightmares out there. Guys. Why not just support the cloud? Why? Why is it only this emergency recovery thing in certain circumstances, which they didn't even clarify? I would assume it has something to do with trying to game Animal Crossing in the way of if you had a great save that had everything and you sent it, you sent it in quotes over to another. No, that doesn't make sense to me. Either. Is it just that it was in development before cloud saves were? No, implemented? I don't buy that. I don't, don't buy think so? that. Nintendo's they weird have, about they, it. Right? They Pokemon's weird about it. They have to. The, the, the emergency recovery thing, I feel, is the least they can do because, you know, people do over the years put so much. We were talking about at dinner last night about how there are people that still play the N64, sorry, the uh, GameCube, GameCube Animal GameCube. Crossing and share their mail the game card around. They've, yeah. been, playing, they've <laughs> been developing these islands, these, these, these areas for years. Right. Like people get really invested in their little Animal Crossing world. And, and if you lost your Switch or whatever, you'd be devastated. People in the chat are saying, well, yeah, you, you know, you don't do the cloud save to stop from cheating, which is what I was... Uh, but who cares? Like it's... It's not like there's online leaderboards. It's not like it's a multiplayer thing. You know, right. you, you want to cheat yourself of the experience of you mm. know grinding up. You want to get right to where it needs to be. Go for it. Now, speaking of cheating, though, are we going to say we're in the same hemisphere, or am I, one of us going to be in the other hemisphere so we get the other stuff that happens in like winter? <sighs> so we don't have to wait until it's actually that. Season. I got. I, I can't. What do What was it the difference like, between the two hemispheres? Well, you know how weather's different down south than it is up here in the north. It's the opposite. Yeah. You know so how, like, like their during, winters are summer. Yeah. Our summers their winter. Oh, right. So, so just, you, you, you would make that choice based on what hemisphere you're actually in. So if you want Australia, if you're in Australia, you want to have exactly you want to have summer in December. Sure. Yeah. OK, that makes yeah. sense. So we could game the system and do it, but I can't. I, I want it I to match like real that. life. Yeah, I got, it's got to match I, real life. I, I don't do think that. I can do that. Gary, how do you feel about that? I'm a, I'm a Norman, 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 Norman. I'm a Northern Hemisphere guy. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> are, are, you're a Norman what? No, I'm all, what about, are you a Norman? I'm all about the Northern Hemisphere. Oh, my God. Yeah. I can't do it. I have to have a match. Yeah. I want to celebrate the seasons as they happen. Yeah, too. I want, you know, I want Christmas time and, you know, all that oh good gosh, stuff. Oh my gosh, yeah, with the cute little lights. Oh god, I love it. I like that one of my favorite things in Animal Crossing is the seasonal. Oh yeah. Events. It's such a big deal. Yeah. When it changes, ooh, yeah, what's going to be? Yeah, and they always and there's always like special little things to do. I used, I love that in all games. Like when I used to play Warcraft, I used to love it when it was like Oh yeah. Um uh I can't remember what they call it now. Uh, what's I can't remember what Christmas in Azeroth is called. It's called something else. Um but Oh, the Feast of Winter's Veil. Vale. That's what it's called. Oh, okay. And, you know, you do, and there's like stupid little seasonal mini things that you do. And Great Father Winter comes and hangs out in Iron Forge and gives out presents to all the girls and boys. It's yeah. great. I yeah, like yeah, love yeah, all yeah. that shit. Yeah, that's fun. And, I, and, 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 you know, that's that's been a part of the Animal Crossing DNA forever. So okay. I look forward to that too. Well, it seems like we're high on it. Ladies and gentlemen, on YouTube one month slash kind of funny games. Are you high on us? Let us know on it, not us. On the comments below, <laughs> tell it. It's six in the morning still here. It's early and there's what, a lot of What shows a left. terrible year for it to be a leap year because that's one extra day we have Ooh, to wait. Oh, damn. Fuck. You brought that up. I didn't even think about that. <laughs> no, I didn't even you. think about that. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, of course, we live react on twitch.tv slash kind of funny games. If you're ever awake when we're reacting, come hang out with us or watch us record the shows like Games Daily and all the morning shows over there. Uh, if you're on YouTube, subscribe, like, and share. If you're on podcasts, we didn't put this up on podcasts. How did you get it? That's weird. It's weird, right, Kevin? How would they have gotten it? What are they doing? Until next time, ladies and gentlemen, it's been our pleasure to serve you. <laughs>